Good evening, everybody. Greetings, greetings. So, my name is Michael, and I'm uh, I'm from Estonia, and I have been Skyway investor and with Skyway with about three years now, and uh, the time has flown, as I can say time flies and well i'm very happy that i made this decision three years ago and then uh, got the chance to get to know this information and this technology myself of course first when i heard it i was like wow this this is something this is something i have been waiting for i've been looking for something new, totally different than than i know that exists today and then after the first information, well, after I received my first information, I, I immediately opened my back office and then went, dived into the information. So, so to get more, know more about all this uh, material and all that, all about the technology and, and the aspects and of course the invest, investment part as well. Because as you might understand then, or know that uh, today still we have a opportunity to to invest, to basically give our financial offer to, to the company and receive valuable shares. And then these shares will be nominated uh, at the price uh, of one US dollar each. But today we, we can receive much more for one US dollar. Of course, there are different packages in your back office, uh, which you choose and then so on. And, um, and I urge you to, if you still have not yet opened your back office or, or you, you are hearing this information for the first or maybe the second time, then go contact your, um, the person who, who gave you this information and, and let him show you or help you to open your back office, do the verification process, um, which is also very important. So people also the um, system that it's really you, not not a robot or, or uh, you know, as you know, the fake a fake person or fake account. That's why the verification process is important as well as to transfer the money to your back office so you can make the investments. And this week is the last week when we have this chance to to invest in this or, or to take part in this campaign called Active Start. All the necessary details again are located in your back office. So I mm, I say that go go there, log into your back office, and then see yourself what are the terms. But I can say that much that uh, after this active start, well, basically this is one very good chance to start sharing this information very successfully to to all the uh, people uh, in your community. Yes, but all right, let's see more. What do we have? I today welcome you to the 21st century and more we are going to talk about the technology itself, about this 21st century technology called Way. I will tell you why it's so special, a little bit uh, briefly about the history as well. And of course I will, uh, I will I will basically um, point out the why uh, why Skyway is here to stay, why it will, uh, so to say, rock the world, and then it will will be the technology that is going to be used uh, worldwide. So, first about let's see the history, and already hundreds of years ago. This photo actually is made a little bit less than 100 years ago. Uh, one artist who pictured the, the future, as you can see on this picture, but I have seen similar photos as well, or, or, or pictures as well, in paintings, where, where artists see that uh, we are going to the second level. And if you think about it, then what else opportunities do we have? Because um, in, in most of the bigger cities where the infrastructure for the first level is very well built already, then, um, well, for example, there are taxis, there are 
cars, tramway, trolley buses, uh, trains, also underground there is subway or metro and and, uh, and there's the problems still exist the problems still occur and, and even get uh, bigger because you know due to the rise of population and to the um, urbanism that people are coming to live more in the urban areas then basically the room which which the city area has well, we, we, we cannot take, tear down the mm, buildings which are next to the road to, to build more road there. It's basically impossible. And that's, that's the reason why, first of all, governments want to, mm, well, suspend or ban or, or basically make, make the cars and, and the vehicles go away inside the cities. So if you go to the city you have to park in suburban areas and then with the transportation system you can move into the into the city or into the city center but that's more in the future and uh, not so much maybe in the future 10 years so approximately but uh, but the other possibility is that we we have to go to this because there is nowhere else we, we have underground transportation we have the first level structure very well built and maintained and then the only reasonable ways to go up and today we have knowledge also for it uh, which is great and amazing and, and has all these benefits that uh, a 21st century technology has to have but let's see more about what we have uh, already today or what human people have built before on the right side you can see the monorail that's um, also widely spread well the tracks are usually very short but uh, you can see here and there this they take attention of uh, put your attention of the, of the structure just uh, remember it how massive the, these are and this one also is monorail on this picture and the similar one is being is built in uh, dubai as well which i have seen myself and i did a research as well because of my university thesis then um, what i found out was that uh, one kilometer cost in Dubai, I mean, the monorail track, one kilometer cost uh, approximately 70 million US dollars. And as we know, Nadezhda Gozareva, who's the CEO of Unitsky String Transport, she said that um, our track structures uh, prices start from one million US dollar per one kilometer. So it's 70 times cheaper. Of course, there are the models and then all the other aspects, the stations and so on. But uh, the pricing prices are, are very cheap comparing to, to, for example, this monorail. Then in Germany, we have this transportation technology. And also take a look how massive the construction is, the um, supports there and, and quite robust, I might say just remember these photos no, nothing nothing more i just wanted to bring some uh, comparison to you via these uh, photos and this one for example is in china and basically this is a train just upside down and then it has no um, well nothing nothing else uh, meaningful or special about the technology itself it's basically similar to the train but the wheels and the attachment system is on the on the roof and of course metro it's done in moscow this photo very beautiful of course the metro area but uh, again uh, quite old technology itself and these technologies are also very interesting because um, as you might uh, see in, in well ski resorts or in turkey i know i've seen myself and in uh, romania as well and the constant i know there is a uh, in um, let me see see in vietnam phu Quoc island there's also one there's there's the longest one in in the uh, world in the world but what is important here on these pictures to notice is that as you can look on the right side the orange system this is basic wheel the engine which spins and this one pulls the strings 
or or the, well basically the yes the, not the chain 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 is used on the left side but on the right side there's this uh, strings and the models where people uh, are inside those are attached to the string and the string moves and then the cabins as well move so basically the motors are located in in the end or or in in, in the front of the line so and in the world uh, the biggest one those are really really big like, like you know maybe five this uh, um, time meter those really big engines so this is the technology I, idea here but if you take a look at the skyway then, uh, and usually this, the, on the last photo, the, they use fossil fuels as well too, or, or electricity, but yes. Mm, but here on this picture, all these track structures are, are electrified. Each model has its own batteries. So basically, if something happens with the electrifying system in the in the track structure, then the models it, itself, them, they can uh, ride more, more for and um, they are elevated that means they are on the second level and they move themselves uh, for example if we take the unibus in front of the, in front of the picture it has uh, many wheels um, uh, inside the, or well inside the roof roof area and those wheels move they're called motor wheels and those move the um, models so the track doesn't move itself but the models the machine the, these uh, these are moving and as you can see there are a, lot, a big variety of different models and these are only just few of them models are in under construction or under development right now for example the unicont which is meant for c containers i will show you the pictures as well later all right but uh, uh, let's see why skyway it's a very important question Many people ask that, then tell me why Skyway, why it's this technology, not something else. And now it's this time to, to tell you. First of all, it is innovative. It is this, uh, this century technology. It is electrified, does not use any fossil fuels. It looks great and, uh, and it can be even lifted up to 50 to 100 meters high so it can go over the forests or the mountains. We do not need to explode the mountains like they do in the Nordics, basically make, to make, make the mountains explode and then clean the, clean the path. After dig, you know, that you have to fill if, if uh, people um, build this train structure, for example, they have to dig up to seven meters underground to make the road very very so so it wouldn't you know go off in in uh, in five five years or so so it could last it also comes as i said the, the track structure but now let's look inside the track structure and inside it there is this, uh, well the strings also patented patented technology by Anatoly Niski and Skyway. These strings are pre-stressed with a special mechanism, and the road the rail is filled with a special filler concrete, and so it makes it more smooth to drive on it, and also uh, less noise reduction make, makes less no noise. So basically, yeah, this is the and the rail head is covered with special uh, metals. So it'd be very smooth and again, um, make the vibration less. Here is uh, one picture I made in a few years ago in 2019 in EcoFest. Great event. Uh, unfortunately, there was, well, not unfortunately, but uh, last year it was uh, um, held differently. It was online, in online format and of course, Antonio Niski and the crew showed us um, via uh, online what is hap what was happening there, and and it was also very interesting. And it's look it um, afterwards as well. If you if you haven't seen EcoFest 2020, then I recommend you to go to your back office uh, and then uh, search the news uh, from there, and you can you can see the whole show from from your back office. But uh, Ecofest 2019 was special because the people could go there, 
myself I was dead as well I made a video so if you go put my name in the YouTube you can easily find the one minute short uh, video about the uh, EcoFest and of course there are many of different people who have uploaded videos and it's 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 amazing and I got the chance to try with this uh, model what you see there up high the unicar and being up uh, air up about 50 meters above the ground and seeing all this area from above it's it's amazing and just imagine that these models go up to 150 kilometers per hour so wow just amazing but all right let's move on time flies mm, second point is that skyway is ecological as i already mentioned it uses electricity and uh, it's planned to produce the electricity from solar panels and wind turbines as well as uh, the models themselves they make especially the um, monorail track which is uh, the unicar which you showed you on the last picture so when, when the model goes down it it collects energy it goes up up it uses it again but it's possible to make it so that it uh, it uses less than than it, uh, it it's possible to um, collect of course that's uh, again in the future and at first we need to focus that uh, that the tracks and all, all the strategic part works very well and uh, but uh, yes we know that electricity is possible to produce from uh, solar and from wind very easily and the technologies already exist and uh, and it's planned to use them as well and as you can see on this picture because there's more than a thousand words it elegant suits well into the area as well and then collides with the nature uh, I, I believe better than uh, this one on the, on the next picture, as you can see. Yes. Mm -hmm. I think uh, the only word is CO2 here on the slide, which I would like to say, and then these levels have, have to be reduced in near future. So technologies which are which are not going over to electricity engine engines which use electricity there and those uh, those will be left behind so that's why skyway is already ahead or was ahead five years ago when when they thought this uh, or, or they started to develop this technology well actually skyway the idea was was existing already uh, 40 years ago in the head of Anatoly Nitsky when he made his first sketches but in reality the first uh, models and and the tracks were built in 2015 or the process started in Belarus and the next aspect is about the wind resistance and the skyway is about 10 times uh, the wind resistance with skyway is about 10 times less than with normal cars or even sports car and that's mainly because of the screen effect and the shape of uh, the model it's made a very wind cutting shape and of course the screen effect comes from uh, from this fact that the cars have road beneath roads beneath them so when the wind comes in front of the car it goes under the car and it will collide with the uh, asphalt or the road there but uh, with uni unibus or uni car we have this uh, possibility for the wind to go beneath it and so there will be no obstacles then of course the first level of the ground floor problems in the winter time the snow can lift the trains the commercial trains that's why it's necessary to use special heavy trains which will clear off. or in the tropical climates there there are uh, big or strong winds which um, basically each day can bring something different on the roads and it, it, it's very costly to maintain 24 uh, 7 these roads because if you if you think about the right side the picture on the right side then it's basically impossible the left uh, road uh, the left side road it's basically impossible to drive over there with a small smaller car maybe with with a we or or the bigger jeep or something but not with with the normal car so that's why it needs maintaining and this picture I actually already described before on the right side the explosion is the keyword and on the left side the filling well first of all cutting the forest or cutting uh, making the land 
possible to to build build or construct a road, and then we need to dig it uh, up to seven meters below to road could be very solid and it's also very it takes a lot of effort and it's very costly to do that and here you can see at skyway it makes people smile i know you can smile and then what's special about this is well basically we can put um, supports at anchor supports after every 400 meters 600 meters depending how how much way the road has to take but uh, of course well for this example it can be after every 400 meters maybe even longer uh, only anchor supports and then the road is up in the air so we do not need to cut down the forests or, or so on or to fill something to make the uh, supports there so that's why it's it's much cheaper also and not to talk about uh, the glamorous and, and, and the efficiency and the speed, of course, 150 kilometers per hour. It's, it's, it, and the high speed unibus that one goes up to 600 kilometers per hour. And the, the, the road or the structure for that one will, will, the building will start soon. And of course, the sea or rivers are not the obstacle as well. For Skyway, it's possible there as well. Yes, so let's move on. Then we have this, uh, due to the population growth, and then that I told you before as well, the, inside the bigger cities, the main problem is that the, there is no place else to build new roads. Mm, we, because we clear down, just take down the houses and to build roads, so we need another efficient solutions. And then the Skyway is the one that can, that can uh, comprehend with, uh, with these situations. Taking, by taking us to the next level, as you can see on these pictures as well. These are uh, animations made especially for uh, Arab, uh, United Arab Emirates and uh, also the, these structures, the left, uh, the structure on the left side, that one already exists. And on the right side uh, is being, is currently being under construction. And uh, the right side should be 2.5 kilometers long and then the left side is, uh, right now it's 400 meters long. And the uh, tests with human beings or the passengers or start um, uh, this month. So, and af after a few months, uh, there will be, well, the track for two, hundred, two and a half kilometer track should be in quite well uh, positioned or, or, or in quite well shape to start uh, testing as well. So let's see. I myself, I personally seen already the supports there placed mm, for the new track and then that's, that's great to see the development we have this corona crisis development has continued very very uh, very well third uh, point is a lot of people also ask is it safe uh, what's going on if it's so if it's up there so what's uh, going on if something happens or yeah I can say it's perfectly safe because the fall uh, it has this patented technology which is called motor wheel so if we turn upside down the, the model um, well I just saw in the last picture if you basically take this uh, unibus and you put it like this or, or, or rise over so then um, it will attach there very well it won't go or, or fall off or something and, and um, even a few years ago there was a accident as well in uh, Echo, Echo Park, where a tractor, where there was a communication problems, I think, but the tractor uh, drove in front of the unibus, which was in test mode, and it, they collide, but the unibus was again there. It uh, mm, didn't fall off, or, or it was just a little bit off shape just a little bit, but uh, everything was uh, perfectly fine with it. It could even drive back and forth, continue driving. But the tractor, uh, with tractor, it, it didn't go so well. Of course, the pilot or, or the driver in the tractor, he's well now, so uh, no, it cost no human lives, but it showed very well what could happen. But uh, back then, we didn't have a technology integrated like this here. The, all this automated and uh, the smart, intelligent, um, uh, systems 
so basically Anatoly Nitsky showed us uh, recently also uh, one test or, or video where he ran in front of the Unibus and the Unibus got a chance to because there was a space, he got a chance to start moving, it, it moved and when Anatoly Nitsky stopped immediately then the Unibus stopped or when Anatoly Nitsky started running toward the Unibus then the Unibus also uh, started uh, going backwards so Mm, as you can see, all this they think about all these uh, possibilities, and and uh, well, it has to be thought because uh, if, or what happens when something happens with the model, or for a, for well example, it stops working. Mm, a similar model that uh, collides or or matches, well, it it front uh, knows basically matches with the backside of the other model as you can see on this picture there are special shape, shaped elements and it can basically pull or or push the, the another the broken um, uh, unibus for example into the well maintenance area or where it has to be pushed or, or pulled so also that system we have or we have thought about that one and then if really we need to get off from the from the model then there are in use there is well the system as you can see on this picture basically the straps you put it around your body and you left town and it's like similar like helicopters or, or other air airborne uh, just have and one last video about the topic safety Yes, this looks like uh, trying a, riding a train nowadays in, in uh, Pakistan or India or these countries. So we have a few more points to cover. Fourth point, very shortly, we have our own, you can understand by now already, so we are not just showing uh, people the catalog or, or, or the pictures, but we have real models already certified as well by Russian and Belarus standard. And, uh, and uh, currently the, the certification process goes on in um, Sharjah, in the Innovation Center. For Unibus, it started in Europe in the, begin in the end of last year. So the work goes on every day, very actively. And and it's great and i will show you pictures of this this unicant this is a revolutionary and as i understood more than 100 kilometer track will be built soon in uh, well it, it will connect a city called korfakan and sarja and it's made uh, especially for this unicant and then the as well they they're telling, telling or, or um, about making it the two in one, so the Unicorn and, and Unibus as well, so both the cargo and, and people can and can drive with, with Skyway, which is reasonable, of course. One more picture of how it looks like. And what is more uh, good to understand is that when we think about trams or trains, then it's you can go only with uh, only one side. Uh, you can ride with, with a train or tram. Well. The, the technology itself can go only one side it cannot go like sides or when there are uh, separate tracks but with skyway you can put the uh, connect the models um, on the track and under the track as well so it can go both sides on the same track that's what why it makes which makes it efficient as well so the fifth point almost in the end we are almost in the end, but the fifth point is that demand for Skyway is everywhere today. So that's why we are we are at the right place in the right time. The sixth point, we have strong and professional team, as I told you before, that we have a offices and a demonstration and certification center in Belarus. Most of the workers also are located there. So Anatolianiski crew is grown uh, over a thousand uh, people by the day and it, and it's growing. Of course, it takes it, the energy to, um, well, 
guide all these uh, people and to to assess and uh, well the necessary works what have to be done to them so it, it takes a lot of work and Jason, so all of you who, have, who are already investors and who know this information and have been supporting uh, Anatoly and Iski because uh, thanks to investors, all this, yeah. so well, the technology has done so well. So uh, we have a great mind behind the idea. So, yes, yeah. it's just brilliant to see him working like that. And seven point, the last point. The last word, Skyway is financially beneficial, and I can see two big um, sides here or, or circles. Is uh, customer who who orders the track structure, let it be, for example, a, a organization or government, and then uh, well, and of course, if you look at the prices, then the Skyway trumps all of. The this technology is also reasonable. And the other side, the other circle is uh, or are right now the investors who who are giving to the company by, by money, I mean, well, investing and uh, receiving uh, very valuable shares. So and after we go to IPO uh, on the, to the public market, or, or we can receive dividends when the projects uh, turn out to be profitable, and and so on. So it just takes some time because it's really, really, really massive to do to build these tracks and to all the paperwork and then bureaucracy and so on. So it takes it takes some time. But when it's the, when the wheel starts, then or ball starts. Uh, <laughs> going then it go, grows and grows and grows so we will see the results soon as well they mentioned news as well i will bring out some most important news first one is that the certificate started in the last year already so let's wait more news about this uh, section or, or uh, how it has been there Second of all, the, the work with government and with different um, parties in, in such and in the United States. So the governments and delegations go um, often to the Innovation Center to see the test, test the technology and then so uh, to get information they need to understand when and where they could build these tracks and how it all go, much it costs, so on. And already told you about the Corfacan, the new publications. Projects actually, one is the more than 100 kilometers. Um, it's possible to read about this, uh, this information in uh, Vladimir Maslow's last memo. If you go to a back office, then uh, look up the Vladimir Maslow webinar's last memo and describes very well all, all this um, how, how the work is uh, going in, in uh, Sarcha I managed to do that and in Korofakan of course they are thinking of, uh, to, to construct a smaller more than 10 kilometer road only for, for public transportation then then well there was a great Mm, so named uh, like you see on the screen right now and actually I I have already told you all the, these reasons so I will not uh, repeat myself anymore if you want to know uh, if you just just uh, started to you know that in, uh, little bit go, go a little bit back and then you can see all this uh, wise seven wise why skyway and then you will and of course it again in your back office uh, yes and in the end 
always love to picture to people where Dalai Lama is giving his blessing to Anatoly Niskin to Skywind. He said that it's not going to be an easy road, but the uh, so, so and as we know, Dalai Lama has not been wrong before, and then he uh, has this special touch of the universe and the world. So let's see how it all goes. But uh, I'm very positive. I know there are uh, half a million investors as well who are positively, who are very positive about this and sharing this information. So I urge you to do share this information to to your community and start campaign which will end this week more information about active start you will find in your back office so that is uh, is over thank you all for coming uh, or, or watching well i wish you all a lot of health of course uh, positivity success mm and then and, um, courage to share the information about Skyway and courage to invest and take part of this awesome project. And of course, we will see you already in two weeks at the same time. And, um, and yes, that's it. And then we talk more technology and the latest news as well. And let's see what has happened uh, then when we when we meet right, bye everybody thank you for coming and wish you all an amazing uh, continuing week <laughs>